I think they, they lack focus. That's, that's the, that's the mo no, really, it's lack of focus. When, when you start investing public money in things that are not directly impacting the lives of the people, then, then it's, it's lack of A legal luminary and a chieftain of the Hope Progressive Congress, APC, who is eyeing the number seats in Oyo State at the forthcoming 2023 general elections, Barista Akim Agbaje, called on Oyo State Governor to be accountable to and be more responsible to the yearnings of the citizens and the pace at the state. If you spend 22 billion on motor parts, it's, it's outrageous. 22 billion. They are spending another 30 something billion on street lights. They are spending another 5.5 billion on stadium. The school system has collapsed. The infrastructure in these school systems are non existent. The medical health care system has collapsed. The roads are getting bad. Agbaje was speaking with newsmen in his chamber at Okebola area of Ibadan, the US state capital, said the present administration in the state lacks focus as most of the money spent are on things that do not have direct impact on the lives of people in the state. In, in truth, for, for me, once government does not impact lives of people, it has no business been there. It has absolutely no business been there. If I were to use an assessment based on percentages and my own indices of assessing, I, I probably won't give them up to 15%. 15 or 15? 15, no. As the school system improved, as the roads infrastructure improved, as the healthcare system improved, what is the level of security we have? Those, those are things people want to want to look. We have prevalent Okada as a means of transportation. Okada will wound or kill hundred people across the state every day. Agbaje stressed that government spending and payment of salaries to the state workers cannot bring the vast majority of our citizens out of poverty. With the view that anybody that wants to be governor of your state must have spent a significant portion of his adult life here. That way, he's likely to understand the challenges of our people at the grassroots. But if you don't, have not lived here considerably long enough of your adult years, and have visited every nook and cranny of the state when you had no ambition. You know it's different when you have an ambition you begin to look at things through the eyes of your ambition. I have been throughout all the 33 local governments long before I even had this ambition to be governor. You see, when they stay outside of your state and come back, their priorities are misplaced. <laughs>